I'm on my way again, this time on my own. It's Friday afternoon. Right, bye bye Port Nickow. I've got a new uh, flasher wireless uh, microphone, so we'll see if that works. It has a integral dead cat or windshield on it. So Harborside Boat Works, which is where Catman 2 ended up uh, following her uh, wrecking and ex-tropical cyclone Lola and eventual repair. Uh, not much going on at uh, Port Nikau's uh, work berth at the moment. Uh, Wangarei Marine Centre or Oceana Marine in behind. And Hydra's still here so not much has changed. Oh there's a boat and slings on the big travel lift. And over here is the Flash looking racing boat. Oh, it's early outgoing tide. Not a lot of wind around. I think we'll probably head to Parua Bay for the night. A bit of breeze. This will be a test for it. So it has adjustable volume gain and adjustable noise reduction, unlike the other one that was fixed. We're going to head around the end of Manganese Point, which is the first headland down there, into Parua Bay. Oh, we've got a reasonable nor'easter that's on the nose. So we're motoring, there's Jackson's Bay at home uh, mid picture, and we go around the corner at the end of Manganese Point into Parua Bay. Uh, looking further down the harbour, looks like there's an orange tanker in at Marsden Point. And Hard to really see at this stage, but maybe two ships are at Northport. That's a bit darker uh, up harbour, and they were talking about possible showers in the west, the central part of uh, Northland. Fortunately, we're on the east side. Okay, turned on noise cancelling. I'll have to see later what it's like. And I've got it on high. And a gust too, just to help. Oh, there's home. And mooring is in front of the next house uh, to the uh, right. And we've done a bit of a zigzag through the sandbanks. So there's the mooring and on the other side of the sandbar, which continues to encroach upon it. There's the old par on Motokuri Island. At low tide there's an isthmus across the Manganese Point and we're looking over it to the uh, yacht club at Paro Bay and oh there's that houseboat we saw on uh, Wednesday. Oh we did look at buying a house in uh, Far Park which is the north side of uh, Manganese Point but we Decided we like the south side with this uh, bush and non uh, corporate living better. Here's the nook where we've anchored before. We're going to carry on over to the uh, well, north side of Parua Bay, over there. Leopard 46 that was on our dock. There's a sandbank in the middle. Uh, you can get uh, over it uh, when the tide's high, but uh, it's after half tide going out now, so we'll be cautious. Uh, the channel marker port one up ahead, and then it gets uh, deeper again. Oh, 
Oh, I'm planning on going pretty much uh, center picture on the far shore. This is the uh, little township of Parua Bay, so virtually none of these houses were here uh, in the uh, center of this picture when we first came up. The kids went to school at Parua Bay School. Right over here is uh, Wangarei Cruising Club Parua Bay Compound. You know, trailer yachts, so Travelling Light used to live on there. Outboard uh, motor club. And the jib that looks like it's come unfurled and been destroyed. Travelling Light's uh, sitting on a trailer uh, just over under the hill over there. Oh, so anchored, it's not particularly deep up here. Good holding though. Uh, but there's the old wharf, which has been condemned, but people are still using it, so I think they've decided to uh, allow it to be used. Uh, here's the uh, mooring field uh, on the north side of Manganese Point. We're on the other side. Uh, the nooks on the other side of this ridge. Some rocky islands. One there. It's near the Paru Bay. Another island over there. Oh, here's the new wireless Lavalier microphone. So there's the receiver, goes in the USB C port in the bottom of the iPhone 16. Uh, obviously, this is the microphone with its dead cat or windshield. It has a charging case. Much higher quality than the similar idea I had before. I reviewed the uh, video and I think the medium to high noise cancellation rather than high noise cancellation is preferable. It really was reasonably windy there. Uh, it was only sitting on my t-shirt um, and the sound was much more natural at that setting than the high setting. Well, we'll see how we go but uh, it's been a frustrating process to find a, a useful microphone that deals with wind. Saturday morning, a calm night, heavy dew. The uh, All Blacks are playing at uh, uh, sometime just after nine, playing Ireland over in Ireland. So I'll just stay here and watch that, then plan the day. I think that's a sea wind. There's a big fast trimer end over there. And behind it is the Whanarei Cruising Club Parua Bay Compound. Yeah, looks like there's some fog over there. Well, it was an enthralling close test, and even better, Matthew rang in the middle to say he's uh, going to be um, coming up uh, late in the afternoon. Well, we did have a little bit of a southerly, not much. It seems to have died out. It's supposed to come in from the north, so might potter around or the boat until uh, we get a bit of wind. Oh, we need a bit of a clean under the cushion on the helm seat. Oh, that's looking better. I'm also busy cleaning up under the hard top, so I've done the front half. 
Need the back half to go. I don't know if you can see it. I also have the bits of soot left over from the uh, ship that was belching black smoke out of its funnel. Well, that's better, but it's uh, going to take a long time to get all the bits. It's 12 o'clock. A little bit of a northerly in. I'll pop the main up and uh, head off. I need to hook the main head head on and unzip the stack pack. Okay, the main's up. Easy to do it at anchor on with the bridle because uh, even though it swings a bit, you'll be head to wind at the times to get it up inside the lazy jacks. And we don't run out of uh, water motoring to windward. I'll bring the anchor up. So the bridle's undone, and then raise the rest uh, back remotely from the cockpit. Just give the weight of the chain to pull the boat forward. Now I can unhook the bridle. This is held on by a snap shackle. Easily runs over the rollers. Okay, bridles all stowed, and I can do the rest from the cockpit. Uh, here comes the houseboat. Seems to have been moving all around Paroa Bay today. Of course, had to go hard over the front of us while I was up anchor. I always stopped. Okay, we're on our way. Just got the main up at the moment. Not quite sure what's going to happen as we get near the nook. It's not a lot of wind, but uh, we're getting about two hours off high tide, so we should be able to nip over the sandbanks rather than into the wind shadow in the nook. I've just done a job to do that, but you might be able to see the battens haven't popped across. I will hop up on deck and see whether I can pull the boom to do that. There we go. It's got one curving the right way. Well, not exactly speedy, but uh, making progress, and it's quite pleasant, even if it is mostly overcast. Well, it remains slow, but uh, steady progress. We're doing almost two knots. Oh, I've got to jump up now, doing a nice broad reach, so a bit more speed. There's looking over to the nook. Oh, there we go, the other... Uh, Method 46 that was behind us at the marina, underneath Mount Manaya, Macquarie Island. Uh, we'll soon be turning to port, heading in about that direction to get over the sandbank and uh, deep a bit. Well, we've made our turn. Not sure there's a lot of wind out there. Uh, heading across towards the eastern headland of the entrance to Power Rail Bay. Getting back down the broad reach. You have to remember to keep uh, muting the radio or the stereo to stop getting any potential copyright strikes. And they can be a right world pain when you have to go and mute that track. Because I don't want anyone to make money off my videos. Well, YouTube does, but I can't stop that. Oh, there's the end of Manganese Point. So I think we might stop go around that and go past home again. We were way up there, I see the houseboat still zigzagging its way around the bay. Right, lunch on the go, home getting closer. And sailing along pleasantly, but not particularly fast. Well, there's home. And mooring. And here's 
see how many other more currently still above water in the boat.